Hello, I'm Himanshu from Interazo. Today we are showcasing our manufacturing process at our factory, which is located at Hoskote, Bangalore. We'll be showing you how we process panel by panel and what is the final outcome, how do we achieve it. This is my entire team which work over here. The entire setup is 55,000 square feet, which is completely powered by solar energy. Our factory currently runs on entirely on solar energy. The aim to make factory completely green, okay? And we have a 60 kilowatt solar, which is consumed in the daytime. And in the Sundays, it goes back to the grid and saves energy for the BASCOM. At Interazo, we majorly use green panel BWP and green panel MR. BWP comes with 21 years guarantee. And the glue what we use to paste the laminate is Fevicol Lamro. It's an industrial glue which is of D3 grade. This is our green panel MR plywood which comes with 7 years warranty from green panel industries. This is how a laminate is pressed on both the sides of the board and then it goes into a pressing machine which can carry entire 50 boards in one shot and it will be kept for 6 hours for drying. And this is a cold press machine. Over here we have two cold press. So totally we can press 100 boards in one shot. After pressing, there's a process called saw. Like we have to cut the uh, entire sheet of plywood into multiple pieces as per the requirement. Then we have machines from HOMAG to process it. All these are German machines. The pressing machine, what you saw, are Indian machines from Jai Modula and Woodtech. And uh, over here, you can see it's all system generated patterns, basically, like based on the drawings which get finalized. That goes to our IMOS engineers, which are mechanical engineers. They process it into their CAD CAM and it is displayed over here. And now it shows like the entire sheet, which will be given to the machine, will be cut into three pieces based on the, based on the dimensions over there. And then a the sticker will be generated, which will be pasted on the panel, which will have all the information of the cutting, of the edging information, and with the barcode for the next machines to process. In the edging process, we have two edge binders, one with the primling one and one without primling. Without primling we use for carcass, primling one we use for shutters, so that the finish comes much better. And in carcass we use 2mm edge binding and for shutters also we use 2mm and 1.3 mm edge binding based on the finish on top. And for the premium finishes like glass and acrylic we will have 1mm edge binding. And this is the premium acrylic which is on birch fly. The edging is done over here on one side of the panel. This side is still edging has to be done. It's cut from uh, beam saw and then the edging is done. It's rounded on top. Now when the edging is done over here it will be rounded on the corner as well. We are at the CNC machine over here. Here the barcode will be scanned based on the front drilling and the back drilling. And then it goes into the machine. And the machine will process this panel. So like groove for profile lighting, back panel grooving, uh, mini fix holes, hinge holes, all these things will be done in this machine. And we do have dust collectors, which will collect all the dust, which is done through drilling, grooving, as well as saw, while doing edging, and the processing. I'm here at panel saw machine, which is a manual saw, where we have to set the dimensions to cut the board. This is from Alton Drop, which is like pioneer into panel saw machines, and hence we have machine from them. I'll show you now how do we cut a manual setting the dimensions and we cut it. After pressing, cutting, edging and the drilling process, we are here right now assembly in the QC area where we segregate all the panels in the room wise and we assemble them and check as per the drawings. This is how a quickly a box will be assembled. Like this is how we pack them and we dispatch it to the site so that all the materials reaches to the site safely.